Cedarcroft neighborhood. Let's drive through that. Today we are going to take a tour of Cedarcroft neighborhood. This is located in Peachtree City, Georgia, right off McDuff Parkway. So you can easily head up towards Atlanta or go over to Sharpsburg, Noonan area, close to the uh, Costco. Yeah, and we're actually in a little pocket park that's actually run by the town that's in the neighborhood. Let's get started on our tour of Cedarcroft. I am going to go over the location, the HOA or the lack thereof, the number of houses, year built, square foot, schools, and pricing. So feel free to jump ahead if you want to get to those other little details on Cedarcroft. Location, location, location. This neighborhood is located a little bit north of 54, right off of McDuff Parkway. So if you want to go south on McDuff and head east towards Peachtree City or Fayetteville, you can, or you could go west towards Sharpsburg. The county line's not far from Coweta County and the Costco's literally around the corner. They will also be building a Publix over there from that Costco, so it's convenient to all of the shopping. Not to mention that the Walmart and the Home Depot are literally around the corner. There is a railroad that goes kind of behind this neighborhood. But the great thing about Peachtree City is you really don't hear train horns that much because the trains tend to go under bridges, and so there's no need to honk on that horn. The number of houses in this neighborhood is 189 houses, and they were all built between 2001 and 2014. You can see that these houses tend to be traditional looking. They're made with hardy plank. We have one stories, two stories, one and a half stories, all different kinds of mixes in this neighborhood. Our square foot range ranges anywhere from 1,400 to 3,000 square feet. So really this neighborhood is for anyone. If you're looking to downsize, a great neighborhood. If it's your first home, great neighborhood. If you just want a um, home in Peachtree City, this is a great neighborhood to seek out. There is a pocket park, as you may have noticed when we started the intro to this video. That pocket park is managed by the city of Peachtree City, and it has a swing set, slides, all those things, as well as a little book cupboard there that you can exchange books, pick up a book, take it, leave a book, that kind of thing. Let's get into the school system. So we have this neighborhood going to Peachtree City Elementary, Booth Middle, and McIntosh High School. So that's right, y'all. If you have some 16-year-olds out there who have their driver's license, they can drive their golf cart, which is what Peachtree City is famous for, to the McIntosh High School. So this is conveniently located to the golf cart paths. Let's get into a little bit of pricing. So we filmed this in October of 2022 and we had nine houses sell over the last 12 months in this neighborhood. That price, that sold price range was 382,000 all the way up to 612,000. And that leaves us with an average sales price in this neighborhood of 450,000 with the median sales price. Remember guys, median is means in the middle of the data range of 434,000. Other things you'll notice about this neighborhood is it does have street lights and it does have nice sidewalks on it. We were shooting this again, like I said, in October, so you may see some of the leaves falling off the trees. Aren't they gorgeous? As well as some Halloween decorations as everyone's getting ready to the Halloween season. If you want to get a tour of this neighborhood or any other one of them in Peachtree City, let us know. We'll be glad to help you out. 
Let us know what you think about Cedarcroft neighborhood and if it's one of your favorite in Peachtree City. And until next time, bye. bye. Do you want to know more about real estate? Be sure to watch this next video. And don't forget to subscribe. That way you'll know when I drop my next video.